I thought it might be nice to be able to ask Astra about the Super Destroyer to get a little tour of the vessel. So I've added the following inquiry to Astra's voice pack. Tell me about the Super Destroyer. The Super Destroyer. This ship's primary use is for both transportation and deployment of Helldivers. Beginning at the aft end of the vessel, you will find both the Eagle Fighter and of course the dropship in the vehicle docking bay. Tell me about the Eagle. The Eagle is both versatile and efficient, designed to carry out bombing and strafing runs, providing crucial air support when it's most needed on the battlefield. Its payload, capable of transforming the tide of any mission, ranges from devastating napalm to precise cluster bombing. Call in an Eagle Napalm airstrike. Setting it up. Sending in an Eagle! Administering freedom. Pilots behind the controls are highly trained, capable of carrying out pinpoint strikes with swift precision delivering critical support to surface operations within seconds. Helldivers rely heavily on the Eagle, not just for its formidable offensive capabilities, but also for the psychological edge it provides. Knowing that the Eagle can be called upon to deliver such precision and firepower from above instills a sense of confidence and security for Helldivers on the ground. This air support platform is more than just a weapon. It's a guardian angel in the sky, ensuring that Helldivers can complete their missions and extract safely. Tell me about the dropship. The dropship at the rear is kitted out for the extraction of Helldivers and to make larger payload deliveries of hardware to the surface with two very powerful engines designed specifically for this task. The dropship serves as your vital link back to the Super Destroyer following the triumphant conclusion of ground missions. With its tough armor, the dropship can land in almost any situation. It is also fitted with a devastating forward cannon capable of delivering deadly ordnance, ensuring the safety of Helldivers during a challenging dust-off. Access ship management. Ship management. Before midships, you can find the ship management console on the port side bulkhead. This is where you make engineering upgrades to modules, configure stratagems and check your super destroyer profile. Dependent on your financials, you can add a lot to your ordnance here. Access the armory. Midships, the armory. Helldivers must pay close attention in this area. It is where body armor and weapon loadouts for both primary and secondary weapons are prepared. As you progress and your ship management modules are upgraded, you'll have much more variable loadouts to choose from. Again, what you can select from the armory will greatly depend on the success of missions and your financials. Tell me about the forward end of the ship. The forward section of the vessel, bridge operations and tactical. From here, the crew manage deployment of Helldivers and stratagem delivery to the surface. From the observation platform, located at the front, between the Hell pods, you can see other destroyers in the vicinity. Management for the vessel's deployment of both the Eagle and the dropship is carried out by the crew here. In the center of the bridge, you'll see operations and stellar cartography, where you can observe the Galactic War's progression and prepare for deployment. Access Galactic War. Galactic War Progression and Stellar Cartography Interface. This platform enables efficient deployment to ongoing missions or navigation to active war sectors. It facilitates strategic communication, allowing you to invite fellow Helldivers to join your mission efforts. For the Helldivers fresh out of boot camp, it is crucial to select missions that appropriately match your current level of combat readiness. Begin with operations that introduce combat elements at a manageable pace, preparing you for the inevitable increase in challenge. Understand that risk is inherent to all missions, yet some are designed with a gradient of difficulty to accommodate acclimatization to combat conditions. In essence, 
All missions contribute to the war effort with varying degrees of risk. Your mission selection should reflect your readiness to engage in galactic the warfare. Is yours, Helldiver. Take us to the fight.